Okay. Hi, welcome to Selco TV. I'm Rachel Gray, and today I was um, one of the presenters that we had at our first workshop in the Practical Librarian series. We talked a lot about searching, and we gave some tips and tricks both in Elm, and my part of the presentation was on Google, and I'm just going to share a couple of those tips with you right now. One of the coolest things about Google is you can customize the search that you're doing. Uh, your search results can be either safe search, which will eliminate adult and violent content, all the way to being able to open up a new browser window or tab whenever you click on one of the results in your result list to see what the web page is that Google is telling you to visit. To get to this, you'll do your search, uh, any search will do, and then after you hit enter and look at the result page, on the top right there will be a little gear and if you click on that, you can go to search, to, uh, I believe it's called search tools, and that'll let you customize your searches. If you're logged into Google, it'll save it to that profile. So anytime you log into Google with that profile that you've customized, it will go back to that customization. Another really neat feature of Google is the fact that you can do proximity searching. So if you're looking for a web page uh, or information on a specific topic, like uh, indigo, the indigo trade and slavery, you can do that by doing your search terms as like slavery around all in caps a parentheses with the number that you're looking for and then the second search term. So with this example I'll show you over here, it's going to be slavery around for indigo. And that will bring up any websites that have indigo and slavery within four words of each other on the page. The last tip I want to offer to you is a little bit more fun, and this one is a bacon number. Now, if you guys have all seen the Six Degrees of Separation game that's out there on the internet, Kevin Bacon is known for being in many, many movies. Um, not all good, not all bad. And it's really fun to find out what your favorite actor or actress's bacon number is, and you can do that in Google by typing in bacon number and then the name of the person you're interested in. So say you were to type in um, Charlie, uh, Bacon number Charlie Chaplin, you'll see that he's only two steps away from Kevin Bacon because he starred in a movie with Marissa Tomei, I believe, and I'll show you the screen right here. And uh, she starred in a movie with Charlie Chaplin, so only two degrees of separation there. Just a little bit of fun um, there with Google. I'm going to have all my handouts and the PowerPoint presentation available on the Practical Librarian website on the Selco page. So take a look at that, and I'll give you the link down below here. And next time, we'll see you for Practical Librarianship in Ju January on PR and marketing. So stay tuned for more Practical Librarianship.